It's been seven months since I talked to y'all, man. First and foremost, I'm apologize for going away that long. It wasn't all the 2K community for either. Even though the game fell off, that had nothing to do with my disappearance. I am an artist. I'm beyond 2K. So 2K falling off is not the reason I left. For the OG supporters, y'all know there's a lot going on in my life. Especially earlier on this year. You know what I'm saying? I had to step away for a while. I had to let a lot out. And I had to also take a lot in. You know what I'm saying? And I got to be 100 with y'all. Like, I completely lost myself. Like, I really, like, I had a couple fallouts with people. Some people that I held closest. Others, they just start showing true colors. But I had to really lock in on life. Like, I really, I really just, you know, I, I kind of lost everything because I had so much. Like, when I, when I started to break away from streaming... And making videos, I end up having three jobs. I'm in school full time. It, it was a lot going on. Like it all happened at once, because for years I was able to sit right here and play the game in front of y'all for X amount of hours a day. I didn't have to work. I didn't have to do anything. And it's like stuff happened in life, and you gotta be ready to bounce back. So like right now I'm really trying to bounce back. Like I'm 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 starting to really bounce back. Like anything in life can change like in an instant. Like for y'all that don't know, I pretty much I really was just out here to be honest. Like from place to place, doing whatever with whoever. Like I got I got loose. I got real loose. I have to let a lot of stuff out. I have to let a lot of stuff go. And like I ain't gonna lie. Not uploading. Every every like week or two, it'll get to me like bro, I'm really not streaming, I'm really not uploading. Shout out to all the guys that stay with the grind in the two K community though. Y'all all going crazy, man. I ain't gonna lie. I don't wanna say names because I'm gonna forget some and I ain't trying to forget none for real. But y'all know who y'all are. Some of y'all getting logos. A lot of y'all really just boomed on all plats. Y'all y'all did y'all thing this year. But yeah, I had to put the game down. Like life really kicked in. Had stuff to handle, you know. And now I'm really I'm slowly bringing myself back. Like when I was playing the game, bro, y'all don't understand. I was just locked in on the game. Like it was nothing else in life I had to worry about at all. And then when so much other stuff came with school, with relationships, family, it's life. Like, stuff just hit you. And basically, yeah, that's just how I have to get myself together, man. I know last time y'all seen me, I probably had low cut. I don't know what, what, what I had in my head. But, bro, like, a lot going on. So I definitely owe y'all that apology for taking off. But it's a lot of stuff I've been doing to better myself outside of content. You feel me? Like, I've been in the gym like crazy. I've been hooping. And that, I'm going to talk about that in a little bit, too. Like, I'm like I'm just I'm just overall better in myself. Like, I'm doing all of this to be a better me. Like, it's nothing. Not, nothing. It's nothing else to it. Like, it's no, it's, I'm not doing it for nobody. I'm not doing it to impress people on appearance-wise. Mental wise, I'm not doing it for none of that. I'm doing like everything. Like, I started doing a lot over the last like eight months. Like, when I mean like, I let everything get to me. Like, last last March, not the one I just passed, but the March before. I remember I gave my life to God. Six months later. Satan came with everything. He threw the whole, the room, dresser, drawer, refrigerator. He threw everything at me. Like, y'all don't understand. Like, I went I went from 
doing drugs, doing, I was doing a lot of things, like, with whoever and whenever, like, I was, I was, I was out here bad, I'm not gonna lie, and, like, I'm gonna be straightforward with y'all, like, I'm, I'm gonna not even edit this video, I don't know how long this video gonna be, keep in mind, though, it is July 16th, and y'all know I live in the mill, it's hot, I turn my AC off and the fan off to record this video, I want this video to be high audio quality. In fact, let me scoot closer, cause I'm I'm being for real with y'all. Like I'm not gonna top this up, none of that. I'ma just, I might not even throw thumb on it. This gotta be real. You know what I'm saying it's raw. With that being said, like yeah, like I got to doing so much, and now I'm I'm winding down. Like I've been putting down the weed a little bit lately. You know what I'm saying I'm I'm gonna give up the the pens and stuff too. I already gave up juice. I'm telling y'all, like, I I was doing everything. Like, I stopped hitting up people. Like I said, like, I didn't have no distractions before. I got to get back to that. So I can't be letting, you know what I'm saying, no females, no no friends, not even family get in my way of, like, what I'm doing. Like, like, I'm excited I'm going back to school this fall. It's a lot of unfinished business I got there. It's a lot of unfinished business I got right here. That's why I got to, I had to just turn the camera on. Because I'm going to be honest, I was supposed to make this video in April. But I just I just wasn't ready. Like I wasn't I wasn't even striving to get myself back. Like I'm now I'm striving to get myself back. Like I went to church today. It's been a while since I really just sat through a church service. Like I haven't been going to church. Like mentally, spiritually, everything. I just I just wasn't ready. And now I'm getting my stuff back together. Like. It's a lot that been going on. I've been slowly getting myself together, but most most importantly, when it come to right here in this content, y'all like family to me. Like I don't really put my life out here on the internet like crazy, but like for like the people that know that that been around when they seen I start getting inconsistent, they start hitting me up in the DMs and the comments like you good, what's been going on? What the next time you streaming? Shout out to everybody who was to us, uh, trying to stay updated with me, even if I didn't respond right away. I appreciate y'all that really, that really was coming through for me. And I'm going to never forget that. So always remember that. And I'm not one of them people that's going to, oh, you, you're a mob, bro. No, but like, it's, it's bigger than that. Like, on the personal level, like, I, like, I got y'all. And I'm so serious. Like, I really got y'all. So please don't lose y'all socials. Like, for the ones that have really been in contact with me, y'all can really send me y'all number. Like, we family, like, I mean that. Because it's like, really, when you going through a lot, but you see who really family. Because it's blood that turn, and it's people that, from not a can of paint, that was sharing everything. Like, you know what I'm saying? That was willing to be there for everything. Like, being there, like, that's that's family. That's the definition of family. Not all blood family, and not all people, not all strangers are, are true strangers, like, you know what I'm saying? And don't think I'm just, you know what I'm saying, trying to ramble off of this stuff, but, like, I'm just trying to really be, like, 100 with y'all. Like I said, everything I'm saying right now, I'm really, truly, genuinely saying it from the heart. Like, I'm not just going to say anything. Like, I, I truly mean what I'm saying. Like, I really, I really feel like I let myself down. I let y'all down this year. The year is beyond halfway over, so I got a little bit less than halfway to try to turn it around. And that's what I'm going to do. Because at the end of the day, I'm never going to finish where I start. I'm going to always, I'm going to always, I'm going to always go to a checkpoint or make it to the finish line. And right now, I, I got to make it to a checkpoint because I'm still where I started. So I can't, I can't stay where I'm at. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody who really... You know what I'm saying? Been locked in with me, though. Like I said, shout out to all my boys in the 2K community. <sighs> then with 2K, it's like, this just wasn't the this just wasn't the year for me. I feel like I could have definitely went crazy, made a bigger name for myself in comp. But other than that, it's like, realistically, this, this just wasn't, this wasn't my year. To be honest, I thought it was going to be 22. So twenty three, I came out. I don't know, like all y'all that's true OGs. Y'all seen I was I was uploading every day, high quality. I was spending two hours in Photoshop making thumbnails, cause you know what I'm saying I'm new to that. Like I'm not no professional. 
But I'm doing everything right. Like, I'm doing everything right now. My boy Cam going to be making my thumbs. I got some other people that's going to be trying to edit. Hey, I need all editors. I need all editors. You can have all styles. I mess with the anime style. Anime been, anime been holding me down over this past eight months. I promise y'all they have. I done seen some real animes. Like, I done really seen some stuff that, you know what I'm saying? Hey, Attack on Titan, Aaron Yeager, that's the one. I feel like him. Like, I feel like everything turned against me. And I feel like it was like the world against me. And he still won. He still won. I'm still winning. I'm still winning. You feel me? I was losing a battle, but I'm I'm back winning. You feel me? Like, and now I'm in Black Clover. Like, Asta really got nothing. And he turning up on everything. Like, you know what I'm saying? I can't, bro, I can't make this up. Like, bro, anime hit, bro. Like, I messed up that, bro. I knew, y'all know, I've been in the 2K community pretty much my whole life. Dog. I knew, I, everybody know of Steezo, but I never watched Steezo. I never watched him. Like, it's a couple people I know of, but never watched. Like, no matter how big they are, I just don't watch. Like, I never watched. I was never, I've always been a comp player when I got heavy into 2K. I didn't care about the circus jump. But when I start really looking into him, bro, and learning, like, he used to play comp and all of this. Like, he not just no dribbler. Like, he really, I got to play him in 24. He's tough. Like, he, he really, he. He really tough. And I started watching him like within the last like two months. Like, I ain't gonna lie. The way his mixtapes and stuff done, I watch all his OG mixtapes. Like, I sat back for a day and watched all studio videos. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I need them, the anime editing. I mess with that heavy. I'm then there gonna hit his editor up. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Steezo. He an OG that, that really been holding it down every year despite how bad the game is. He gonna get on there and. And, and exploit the game. I'm gonna get on there and show people like you can still play this game how you want to play, cause that's his play style. He play how you want to play. He probably find a way to do it on live if he had to. Like he got it for sure. Shout out these. Shout out these up, man, for sure. But yeah, 24. I'm coming back, man. Like if y'all ain't like, tuned in on the uh on the on the other plats besides YouTube, tap in on Instagram, Twitter. You, uh, I got a second YouTube channel. It's, it's, it's in the description. I'm thinking about a big app. TikTok. Y'all got to be in there on there because I really just be throwing stuff up on TikTok for real. Just because it's just the app that you scroll, you see the video, it never pop up again type junk. So it's just, it's just, I'll just throw stuff on there that'd be important updates about me. So if y'all are not tuned in on there, get tuned in on there. I'll be streaming on there a little bit. Tune in on Kick. I'm streaming on Kick on 24 when I do stream. But 24, the plan for 24 is all high quality content. So um, the everyday uploading, it ain't gonna, I'm not gonna be able to do it. I'm working, I'm in school, and my editing, I'm, I'm taking my time. I'm taking my time. I'd rather drop two videos a week that can potentially blow rather than just spam seven good videos that got a lower chance. I need 10 out of 10s. I need 10 out of 10s. I'm gonna get a new intro, I'm getting a new stream overlay. I'm saying, if y'all really OG, y'all really know about the stream overlay, like, I'm saying. And everybody that be asking, that's another reason I'm changing. Everybody that acts, they be asking about this stream overlay, but they be like, who made it? I, and I be like, I can't tell you because the person that, that made mine, after he made mine, he did my mans and he scammed my mans. Now he's scamming, so, I'm saying. That's another thing. I can't, I can't, I can't have his, his work up here. I can't promote that foolishness. You feel me? I ain't gonna lie. That's bad for business. That's bad for business. So, yeah. I'm gonna get a new intro. And like I said, like, I've really been doing stuff to better myself. Like, I've really been in the gym with my with my day ones, for real. I've really been, you know what I'm saying, working. I've really been, you know what I'm saying, getting content ideas together. Like, I'm really, I'm really relaxed now. So, I can really, I can really think and be in mode. Like, I'm really locked in. Like, I'm extremely locked in. Like, that's why I had to just record this video out the blue. Like, I had no intentions on recording this video until, like, I don't know, probably next week, probably next month, probably when 24 drop. Like, I was going to keep postponing until I felt like I was ready. And today, 
I know I'm ready. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, I'm cutting out all distractions. I've been I've been laying off the off the smoke. You feel me? Uh, I gave up. I put the juice down for good. The smoke next. You know what I'm saying? And then alcohol. I don't really drink, bro. Alcohol just disgusting. I'm cool and that. But I'm really being open with y'all. Like a lot of people don't share this. They just be like. They just go away for a year or however long they go away and come back and just be like, I was going through things. Like, I'm going to be 100 with y'all. Like, and more importantly to myself, like, for a long time, I was doing everything for everybody but me. Like, I'm really doing this for me. Like, I'm doing this to be a better me. Like, me. I'm doing this to be a better me. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm really getting back to my senses. You know what I'm saying? And for people that, that, that grow up and feel like they fall off in life at a period of time and people be disappointed oh you wasn't raised like this this is not it's not about how you was raised it's about how you become remember that you know what i'm saying I, I i was at church today and i was just sitting and people was like looking at me like i always wear church clothes to church i came in with this today like i ain't been in a while i ain't had no clothes clean but i wanted to go and that's what mattered and i'm glad i did Cause a lot of people embrace that. Like it didn't matter about what I had on, but I knew like when I was there, I was just getting thoughts in my head. Like I shouldn't have been there. Cause like I was, a, I looked like an outcast and I felt like an outcast. But in reality, like I'm not like, you can't be quick to think about how other people think about you. Like, and they weren't even thinking about me like that. It's just, I was telling myself that. And I was believing that like, do everything for you, like, not saying you can't look out for other people, but, like, at the end of the day, no matter what you do in life to, to, to progress, you gotta, you gotta go forward, you gotta, you know what I'm saying, and the only way to do that is to be, to be the best you, like, you gotta do it to be a better you, and I'm glad, I, I'm glad I'm starting to think about that now, like, I was always quick to consider other stuff, trying to look at other people's perspective, which is nothing wrong with but you got to remember at the end of the day, when, when you got life decisions you got to make for you, you got to do it to better yourself. Like, I'm going I'm to continuously say that. I'm doing this to be a better me. That's why I've been in the gym. That's why I've been, like, I've really been taking care of myself. Like, I was just letting this grow out at first, like, recklessly. Like, I, I start getting my stuff together. You know what I'm saying? It ain't, it ain't that long yet, but, you know what I'm saying? I can, I can shake my junk a little bit. I just had a bonnet on, so it's really, it's really trying to go to sleep, because I'm finna go to sleep. Well, not no more. I'm wide awake now, but, yeah, I have to really get myself together, man. And people was all in the comments, like, oh, what happened? You and Diddy fell off the face of the earth. Bro, we had, we had to get life together, bro. And shout out my boy Diddy D, bro. That's, that's my brother for real, like, man, Diddy been locked in since 22, bro. And it's crazy, because when 22 first dropped, bro. I was I, he start I start seeing his videos at the end of twenty one. Then I'm like, cause he was doing a lot of a lot of like talking about the it was it was community type videos like he was just talking about how the game been how the game should be how stuff been in the past and what what worked and what do, and what doesn't. And he was he one of the only people that I was listening to that that knew what he was talking about. Cause I ain't gonna lie, I'm not gonna I ain't gonna start no no drama. Cause I'm not even with all that. Anybody got drama with me in the community, we could play, we could run the series, we could put it all out there. You feel me? But on the personal side, it'd be a lot of, a lot of people that don't know what they be talking about, but they got that they got that that name. So a lot of people don't be know what they're talking about. Like he didn't even have a name, and he knew what he was talking about like. So I knew he 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 was one of the real ones out here. Shout out to my boy Diddy. And yeah, I was watching him. And then 22 drop, I was in the stream, like, he was playing the game, he was cool, he was playing with my boy Next Gen, shout out Next Gen, you know what I'm saying, that's my, that's my brother too, no bull, but yeah, we was just, I was just watching him stream, and I was streaking, going crazy, and then, I told, I told my, uh, I told my cousin GB, man, hey, shout out GB, hey, I ain't gonna lie, through thick and thin, that, that's my cousin, but that's my brother on bro, he, he held me down for sure. Throughout me not playing the game, no matter what, no matter when I came back, he hit me like, let's hoop, let's hoop. Like, he was, he kept me going with this for real. Because it was times where I didn't even want to play the game. He'd be like, come on, come hoop. 
know what I'm saying? Hey, shout out GB. Like, no matter what, no matter how how long I take a break from the game, no matter when I I stopped playing the game for like four or five months straight. Like, when I came back instantly, no matter what was going on, anything that involved me, he was with it. If I was in the tens, he was in the tens. If I wanted to start a team, he was on the team. Like, he, he was with it through thick and thin from the beginning since 21. Shout out GB. But, yeah, I told GB, like, bro, I mess with Diddy, bro. Like, he, he really know what he talking about. And one day he was in a park. I still got the screenshot to this day. We was out at the park. He had did his daily spin. He was just standing there. He was off stream. He was just standing there. And I was like, bro, here go this Diddy dude, bro. I was like, Gary, I, I was like, I'm telling you. I was like, I bet you I get to collab with him this year. Or I'm going to start messing with him. And at the time, I have not done a collab. I was solo on everything. Diddy was my first collab. My legit, like my first legit collab. Diddy was my first legit collab. Like, he pulled me in for the park takeover. Uh, if y'all don't know about that 22 park takeover, I don't care what nobody say. That 22 park takeover we did, me, Diddy, who was it? It was me, Diddy, Woody, The General, and Jay Amir. I'm going to never forget. And then we did another one with Q and um and Jay Amir Mass. Hey, them two, them two 22 park takeovers was one of the best 2K community events ever. That That's so slept on. And I put that on everything. I put that, if y'all can go back and watch it, y'all be like, bro, we used the Kobe court on 2K22 that no, nobody else used. Nobody thought about doing one until we did what we did with it. Bro, I'm going to never forget that. In 22, Diddy set up the one of the best 2K community events ever. And I'm standing on that forever. I'm standing on that. And when we do, the next time we do it, when we, when we really up, it's not, like, y'all not even going to understand. It's not even going to be the same. Like, y'all have to be at the, that first, that first one. Like the twenty two ones, he threw a couple in twenty two. I wasn't in all of them, but them 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 community events, you have to be there. You can rewatch it so you can see how great it was. But you have to be there. We was using the, like we we like when y'all don't understand the fact that when y'all when y'all look back and watch it, or if y'all remember, bro, the Kobe Court, the internet was terrible. Like not the internet, the server was terrible. Like and we was making it work. We was streaking ten streak. Then the court got corrupted. The park server cor something corrupted. We was finna we was finna streak on that court all night, and it was and it was good. Like it was it was it was good. It was good. Like supporters pulling up. Like I never say fans. It was good supporters pulling up. It was good supporters pulling. Like it, we had fun. Like we all showed out. Like stuff like that. Like I'm gonna never forget. After that takeover, bro. We just. We was locked in. We were streaking on the twos. Then, you know, I kept GB with me because Diddy really was a twos guy. He wasn't big on threes. I had GB with me. GB, he was good. He always been a defensive-minded player no matter what position. So, Diddy was cool with that. We was just running. Ran up 3v3 pro. We was running everything. 5v5. I got Diddy into 5v5. Like, he used to play 5v5 back in the day, but he wasn't, he wasn't really messing with 5v5 like comp was. Like, he wasn't messing with that. He was only playing wreck to get ripped. And other than that, he was we was on the twos. You know what I'm saying? We had that journey and then And it's crazy how I'm going back telling this story in order all towards it leads up today. Like then that's when that we came out in twenty three, like I said, twenty three. Bro, we went on a sixty something game win streak the, the the day the game came out. The next day. That night, you know the you know the courts was valued. Making our player bills. Nobody knew about the shot timing for real. Bro, the next day, we, we streak all night. That Saturday night until that Sunday, we streak. I didn't even go to church because we was streaking. We, bro, we was locked in. Me and Diddy went on a 6 7 if, if, if somebody known like Steve's or somebody would have pulled up, that, that whole day could have changed everything, to be honest. We was just playing. Like, wasn't nobody pulling up. We just, it was just reg regular people pulling up. And then the game just came out. So you don't know who good and who not. We just thrashing everybody. We're thrashing everybody. Literally. We was putting people through there. Every Like, every game. Like, that video on my channel, too. It's a video that's titled something about my parents about to kick me out. Like, it's in the video. They was yelling at me. Me at streak. We're, like, on a 60-something game win streak. And they, get off the game, this and that. Yeah, go to school, all it like, bro. I'm telling you, I was playing the game. I was doing nothing else in life. It, it's a, from an outside perspective. 
if you think about somebody who just played a game their whole life and don't do nothing with themselves, you would think they just throwing themselves away or they failing that life. But that wasn't the case. Like, I was really genuinely on the content ground. I wasn't doing this. Not to say I wasn't doing it for free, which I'm not. But, like, I wasn't doing this without no purpose in life. I wasn't doing this without, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't doing this and not living my life. I, this this was involved. This was a big part of my life at that. Like, it was just, it was helping me survive. Like I said, I'm, I'm getting paid for it. It's just, you know. Then I, it all came back to what I was saying before about what's been going on these last couple months after that. And like I said, for 24, I'm back locked in. That's all it come down to. Like I said before, like I've been in the gym and all of that. Again, I'm doing that to be a better me. I'm doing that to be a better me. You feel me? But not not only that, though. I've really been um, hooping and stuff. So if y'all don't know, before 2K, I was outside. I was one of them ones. I was hooping. I say up to middle school. Once middle school came, it was like, you know what I'm saying? I, I stopped hooping as much. I went, that's because I wasn't, I wasn't going nowhere. I was stuck in the house. So when I got stuck in the house, that's when I got, that's when I really picked up 2K. Legitly. 2K15. Christmas. I'll never forget. That's when I really picked it up and ran with it. Then I met, I met my boy Kicks Got Next, man. I met my boy Eric Record, man. Shout out my boy Eric, man. Like, you know what I'm saying it's, it's deeper than the game. Like he really, he really helped me grow into the comp scene. He really helped me get the knowledge I needed, and now it's like I'm, I'm just, I'm continuously building. You know what I'm saying, 2K24 gonna be cross play. He's saying he's not gonna play. I'm gonna get us some dogs. He gonna play an overnight with me or something. We gonna win something together because we never won nothing. We always been the final fours and elite eights, all that good stuff. We always been far. We never won. We're we're gonna win, and we're gonna make something major. I'm gonna get us into a WR or something. We gonna, and then I'm gonna come back to this video when that happens. We are gonna win something this year, Eric. I promise. You know what I'm saying I'm I'm locked in this year. Like I said, man. Shout out, shout out all the guys, man. I only want to get the name and names because I can't forget about y'all. You know what I'm saying everybody that been locked in, we locked in. You know what I'm saying. So with that being said, too, like I said, the IRL content, it's bigger than the game. It's bigger than the game. I got IRL content coming on the way. And I'm doing all of this on one channel. My second channel is a Switch channel. So it's basically the same videos I upload on TikTok. Some don't, some, some I do. Like, for the most part, the YouTube Switch, that channel, I can upload a lot more stuff because the guidelines is not as strict as TikTok. So, you know what I'm saying? The YouTube short channel and the Instagram. Y'all got to tune in on Instagram. I know y'all think about Instagram as just pictures. No, it's content on Instagram. It's bread to be made on Instagram. For all y'all streamers, bro, I know y'all probably don't want to mess with it. Y'all don't want to be having that TikTok label. It's bread in that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can, y'all can, the, the YouTube, the, the Instagram reels, the Twitter, the Facebook reels, all, it's bread in that. You know what I'm saying? I, I do everything. I'm collecting all increments. I'm collecting all increments. As my boy JJ would say, I'm collecting all increments. Like, bro, like, I'm not leaving nothing on the table, bro. Like, I'm... At the end of the day, when I, when I, when I retire with content, I'm going to be able to say I left everything out there. I took everything. I gave everything. That's just going to be what it is, man. Like, seriously. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I'm excited. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad, I'm glad I talked to you all today. Such a such a beautiful day. You know what I'm saying? But I'm about to uh, finish watching Black Clover. You know like I said, I'm not editing this video. I, I was 100 from the, from the beginning to the end. From the beginning to the end, I was a hundred. So you know what I'm saying. Shout out all my guys, man. Shout out the fam. And more importantly, man, shout out all. Shout out, shout out everybody that that that's. All my warriors, man. Like that's, I gotta give y'all the name because y'all not y'all bigger than fans, supporters, y'all y'all. A lot, bro, and it's not like even though people may be like it's not that many of y'all across all platforms, like. No. Like, bro, like I got over 30,000 supporters, bro. Literally. Like, that may not sound like a lot. Like, bro, 
Think about 30,000 people that's across the world. You know what I'm saying? That, that genuinely mess with you. Like, enough to be able to support you through your journey. Like, when you're a content creator or an artist in general, like, it's a journey, bro. And, 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 the, and the way you build up, it's about people following that journey. Like, they gotta, they gotta really mess with you to want to lock in on your journey. Like, I don't know how to put it. It's just like, you know what I'm saying? Just like anime. We gotta really mess with the characters to grow. Like, I don't, I don't, I'm not watching One Piece, bro. Like, y'all a thousand and a half, a thousand, five hundred episodes in, bro. And I'm like, everybody telling me to start it, bro. I got, I got to episode a hundred and the episodes keep going up, bro. No, bro. I'm not catching y'all, bro. It's over. But what I was saying was like, y'all have to, y'all have to mess with Luffy, his story to mess with the show. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's the same thing with anything else. Goku, Dragon Ball Z, y'all have to mess with Goku to mess with the story. You feel me? And, and that's how I feel as an artist, you know what I'm saying? I call myself an artist, not a content creator, because it's, it's it's bigger than, like, it's it's bigger than, than what's on the screen. And that's, that's, that's what I'm, that's, that's the point. I'm going to really, I'm going to get, I'm going to get that across. It's, it's, it's bigger than what's on the screen. But, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate y'all boys for tuning in. If y'all stayed through the whole video, hey, I appreciate y'all. It's been a lot. A lot more to come. A lot more to conquer. Peace. Love my boys. And ladies out there. I know I got a couple of y'all. <laughs> Peace.